I decided to do a review of my little uh, Gerber knife sitting up here on the top of a, I think it's a pin oak. It's a massive tree that I've uh, hunted deer out of in the past. It's been a few years, so I'm having to kind of clean it up again, clean some of the small branches out of the way. Um, rifle season for deer hasn't started yet, but I decided to come down here and do a little bit of coyote hunting and clean up a couple of my tree stands while I was down here. And I realized once I got up here, I should have brought a machete or something with me to clear some of the small branches out of the way. But, fortunately, I had my Gerber with me. And I'm not sure even what model Gerber this is. My good friend at uh, Guns Knife Survival put me onto this knife, and I bought it, and it's been a really good knife. It's a lock back. It's got a, a clip so you can put it on your belt or in your pocket and clip it to the side of the pocket so you won't lose it. Um, and it's got these serrations, which normally I don't like the serrations, but I'm finding that as I uh, try to drop my rifle, I don't have anywhere to put it right now. As I'm cleaning up these branches, I've cleaned up a whole bunch of these little branches, and it works out really good having those serrations on there. So, the Gerber, whatever it's called, it's a really good handy little knife. I'd been in trouble without it. I'd had to have gotten back up here another time and clean up all these branches but uh, as it is I've got it pretty well cleared out so I can see all around as you can see up the tree it's a massive tree and looking back down the tree it's probably a good 20 feet to the bottom I don't actually have a tree stand in this tree it's just got these natural branches that are massive and they make a nice place to sit I got a place to sit a place to rest my back and a place to place my feet so, I didn't actually intend to do a review on the tree, I was just trying to do a review on the knife, but as you can see it's a rainy day and it's, I think it's beautiful out here, beautiful November Kansas day. So, I'm going to try to be quiet now and see if I can call in a couple coyotes. Till next time, be safe. Thanks for watching.